Hello, welcome back. Uh, in the last couple of videos, we are trying to identify the locators. Okay, so we have gone through this location identification techniques, and so far we have already got through ID and we already know name. And in this uh, video, I'm trying to explain how do you locate identification identify a locator by link. Okay, question is, you go to Google.com website, and this is our Google.com website, and you teach Selenium. So that Selenium is going to click on these links down below called Advertising Program, Business Solutions or Privacy Terms. So how do you enable Selenium so that Selenium will able to click on this thing? So what kind of command? So three things you need to figure out, right? As I told, like, you, know, you need to know what command you need to give and what is your target string and is there any option value, which is optional thing, okay? So command, so what do you basically do on a link? you go and click on a link so therefore the command will be click okay and next thing is target how do selenium identify this target which is advertising program to do that what you need to do let's right click here and go to the inspect elements with firebox and basically this is the element you know this is what is the element to uh, for that uh, link okay so the so, so try to answer whatever you so far learned. You learned identification technique by ID and you learn identifying by name. Are you seeing any ID or name? Okay, to simplify this thing, so the same code is here. Okay, so whatever the HTML code, so basically you are looking at this HTML tag. Okay, so in this HTML tag, are you finding anything that is can be done by ID or by name? The answer is no, I don't see any ID or name. Selenium gives you another option. If you see there is a link, then what you can do, you can just write link is equal to what is the link name? The link name is advertising programs. Okay, just that. Advertising programs. You no know double quote, no single quote, just this is going to work. Okay, so let's try to uh, ans you know uh, do that uh, in our example. So basically, I want uh, Selenium ID, which is already available here. And the first thing what I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, do uh, something. Uh, the, the command I'm going to do, I'm going to open, right? So the first command is open. And what open? And I will open http google.com. Okay, so that is the. HTTPS google.com so next thing once the google.com came I want to go to this link okay and click on this thing so therefore the next command would be click okay then click and then what I can what I have to do I have to do the target the target as I told you here if there's if you see a link then you just give link advertising program or whatever the link name okay so so, so basically, uh, in the in the ID, what I'm going to do, I'm going to give link, to, and I have to exactly copy this thing. Okay. Sometimes what happens, they do some kind of space or anything. So just need to copy exactly. And don't trust your instinct. Okay. Just copy whatever is there. Okay. So link equal to paste. Okay. And let's basically to check like you know, if it's, if it's really link finding or not. So let's do a find here. Okay. Yeah, it looks like it's finding. Okay, so now I hope with this it should be able to uh, work. So let's see. Let's try to run this thing. If we are able to um, navigate to that one or not. Okay, so that's what happened. So basically, it uh, like let me, let me rerun again. So first thing is open Google.com. It here is the one. And second thing is just click that advertising program. So let's try to uh, see. One more thing called click and wait. Like, you know, just play with something uh -huh. more called click and wait. So, what click and wait is going to do is going to wait for the new browser to open. Okay. So, let's do click and wait and then run it again. Okay. So, now what I'm going to do once I click and wait, I want to click on this button called get started. Okay. So, how do I do that? So again, like I want to click on this button, right? Get started. So therefore, the command would be again click, right? The command will be click, and then I need to figure out identify this element. 
Okay, so let's do a inspect element. Oh, sorry. I have to go to uh, inspect element with Firebug. Okay, so basically that element is this. Okay, so the question is, can you identify by whatever is given here? The answer is probably no, because you don't have an ID, you do not have a name, we do not have any um, any link. So how do you identify? So that we will learn in the next videos. Okay, you can identify because basically the goal here is that whatever limited identification techniques that you have learned so far is not going to help you in doing this. Okay, therefore we need to figure out something else, and that we are going to do in the next video. Thank you. Uh.